It wasn't like this at first. Now don't act like you don't want to hear what I got to say. Blah, blah, blah. No. you guys and welcome to reviews with Whitney D. I'm Whitney D your host. Let's get into it shall we? All right you guys welcome back. This is reviews with Whitney D story time. So um as you guys may be aware I am in my comments. Oh, As you guys may be aware I am in my comments okay. I try to communicate with you guys to and fro you know when I have time. Otherwise I just kind of ignore your comments and let you guys go at it okay. But nonetheless, um, so a few things have been pointed out to me in my comments and uh, one in particular was sound on one video and as I stated that in the descriptions, if you guys would take out the time to read them, but in the descriptions, I was aware that the sound was as it was, but I had already recorded and it was a lot of information. Y'all know I was uh, reading to and fro on that video and I was not about to record it over. I'm just being honest, but I digress, okay? So the thing is, is that um, it was pointed out about the sound and so, um, you know, uh, I, I wanted to apologize again in regards to that. I'm new to this. I'm trying to adjust things and figure things out as they go. I will get better, so I do apologize apologize nonetheless if you do not know please put this in your notes in the back of your brain okay I do not mind constructive criticism okay on the contrary okay I do not mind constru constructive criticism but there's a difference between being downright out disrespectful and then being constructive okay and it's a way you bring about your presentation about things okay and the thing is is that I'm not gonna allow you to be disrespectful towards me that's not gonna happen period okay and I'm not gonna allow you to feel down about myself when again I am new to this I'm just starting out I think I'm doing pretty good to have 14,000 well actually close to 20,000 views and only a hundred and something subscribers in amount of a month and a half i think i'm doing pretty good okay the channel is still growing i'm still growing as a um creator creator so um just bear with me here okay now with that being said also um some things that were pointed out to me is that um you know i'm not a journalist i am not a journalist if you're coming here for uh, journalistic approaches to situations, go somewhere else, okay? I'm not a journalist. I did not go to school for journalism or anything like that. This is entertainment news, okay? I grab what is out there in the media and I give my perspective, my personal perspective about things, you know? I try to tend to say the things that you want to say but are too afraid to say, but I do it out of love, okay? So if this is something that you're interested in, please stay with the channel. If not, deuces! Now, Another thing, and I'm trying to get all this out so I won't have to do it again. You have a video, you can replay it over and over, okay? Um, I digress is something I've been saying for years to come. If you are a Facebook follower of mine, which I have like 5,000 plus or what have you, and I've been doing this live stuff on, on Facebook for years, okay? I continuously, and even in my real life, say I digress. I actually like the word to be honest with you <laughs> so I, I love digress and um what's my other favorite word incompetent I love those words so I tend to use those words quite frequently and just like I have a favorite Bible verse okay but I use I digress in the right content so I don't see the problem I digress I digress I digress I digress I digress I digress I had someone say in regards to, oh, you're overdoing it. You're trying to be like Grace, whoever the hell that is. I'm trying to be like Whitney. And if you know Whitney, I digress. And with all that being said, it brings me to my story time, okay? Because this is something else that you guys pointed out as if I didn't know. This is story time about me getting my lazy eye. Okay, so um, as you guys can see, as um, um, it's nothing that I'm hiding. I have a, a lazy eye, okay? If you kind of can't notice, I'll scoot further back because it's more so when I am far away that you can see it, but if not, you can see it, okay? Some people call it a cross eye, but mine is not that damaging, but it is a lazy eye. Um, and here's a story in regards to that, okay? So I did not 
I was not born like this or anything to that nature. It's really due to old age, okay? I am 32, <laughs> although I look 12, but you know, you know, I digress. <laughs> I was supposed to be wearing glasses at a very young age. I chose not to because of course, you know, kids can be nasty, four eyes. So, um, I really didn't wear glasses. And as I got older and older, I, my eyes got worse and worse. And so as time went on, I was supposed to wear glasses. Went from not wearing glasses to wearing contacts. And then I didn't want to wear contacts that was prescribed because they didn't have colors at the time, you know, um, that I really liked to have. Very vain, but hey, I was a teenager. What you expect, okay? Didn't wear contacts, didn't wear glasses, and as time went on and as I just got older, uh, my eyesight got worse, okay? And so um, I didn't do anything about it. And so I started doing, I, mean, I started doing, I was involving in my modeling career, acting career, and um, I was working for a, um, a corporate uh, and I was actually in the office and I was sitting at my desk and mind you I stayed in front of the computer so uh, I was sitting at my desk and I remember my employer coming into the office to check on me and I looked up at him and my eyes went together and I was like whoa what was that you know and so I corrected them and I was like okay that's weird you know but whatever you know maybe I'm looking at this computer too long so I got up and I took myself from my computer and you know rested my eyes and so didn't really happen again. Time went on. I found myself at home one time and my mom was coming into the room and I looked up at her and my eyes went cross again. I was like, whoa, 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 it's doing it again. Wait a minute, you know? And so again, didn't think nothing of it. I was just like, okay, maybe I'm just tired. I'm gonna get some rest. Time went on again. Still not doing anything in regards to my eyesight. Um, and so years and years went on, okay? And I remember being at a photo shoot this time. Years has passed on, I, um, one marriage down. And I remember looking at the photographer and I couldn't really see him. My eyes would start shaking. I was just like, whoa, okay, what is going on? Maybe I'm tired, I'm, you know, I'm doing too much. I would literally have photo shoots throughout the week up until weekends every other weekend i was having a runway you know show a fashion show so i was very busy in my modeling career at that time so i just uh charged it to me being tired and so time went on again and didn't do anything about my eyesight so i get into my now marriage and um i found myself you know again having a hard time seeing would you know if i would look far off it would hurt my eyes i would get uh migraines and everything and so i um was like okay something's not right i started doing my research and i started looking up all these different terms for what i thought i had going on and i'll leave it here or somewhere where you can read about it um because uh, it's different versions of it so different um definitions of it um, I recently pinpointed the exact one that I have. It is reversible, but I just have not been putting forth the effort to take care of it. And so um, I'm going to, as time went on, I, I, I figured out what it was. And so I found out that with prisms and glasses, it will help correct my eyesight. And so I um, purchased some glasses and I've been taking care of it, but also um, the uh, patch uh treatment so um as time went on um i actually um you know purchased the glasses i'm um, actually when i went to america's best and did the little two little deal and got the eye corrective they actually told me a different version of what i had going on and that's when i discovered that that was really what was going on with my eyesight and it was like oh it's, it's it's worse cases than what your eye is like it's just whenever um you you try to see far off you have the issue and mind you i have two different um prescriptions in my eyes the particular eye that goes lazy is um nearsighted meaning it sees better near this eye is farsighted i see better far so in those cases they're conflicting with each other until i get to a, a, a area in which it's okay with both of them okay so that's what the confliction is with my eye. That's what's causing my eye to be lazy because this eye is like, uh, -uh I, I ain't finna work that hard. I'm finna just be lazy. I'm finna just shoot across, you know? So, you know, um, with that being said, I had some people in the comments stating, you know, oh, cross, cross eyed, um, blah, blah, blah. You, you, come here, come here. I am not easily offended. Some stuff is true. I'm skinny, I'm black. I'm cross-eyed. I, I, what can you say? Now, as far as the whole uh, 
he she she he come on now y'all better stop it okay like come on now i'm cute okay but i digress in regards to that, my lazy eye can happen to you, okay? You, 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 across the screen, all right? Take care of your vision, okay? If you're in front of the TV all the time, if you're in front of a computer, in front of your phone like this all the time, it can happen to you. Get off of that screen. Just breathe. Enjoy life. Go outside. Let your eyes rest and take in other things. And just love on your eyes and love you as a person. I myself do a trillion quadrillion things before i try to focus on me and so um i'm trying to do better with that you know um and you know the thing is this though why i tend to uh kind of go back and forth with you guys in the comments just a little bit because i'm not gonna let you just i'm not no i'm not no punk okay you can learn a lot from your enemies you can learn a lot from your haters because they're gonna be honest with you your friends gonna be like oh no girl you're throwing with your eye you cute oh no girl no you can't even tell girl just close that eye you look good but your enemies gonna be like you all crossed out ashy blah, blah, blah. oh i'm ashy you know you get some lotion and it makes you do better so i don't care okay i am strong i am empowered i am not weak-minded you will be blocking on real fast if you come out and disrespect me but this channel is safe i'm gonna block you if you don't agree with me Let's agree to disagree and let's not get offended by one's opinion in 2019, okay? That has been story time with Whitney D. Tell me about your story. Do you suffer with a lazy eye or a cross eye? Are you in a, a midst of being bullied by people? Well, I'm here to encourage you, okay? Some stuff is true, some stuff is not. You chew what is according to you and do better and the rest throw it out and put it in the trash where it belongs, okay? let's do better with one another in this in this year okay we got enough going on in society okay but if you're looking for some encouragement stay here this has been reviews with whitney d i'm whitney d while you're in the comments though please take out the time to like share and subscribe already a subscriber great please do not forget to click that notification bell though so you'll know every time i upload okay thank you so very much this has been story time with whitney d reviews with whitney d Bye. Now don't act like you don't wanna hear what I got to say. I digress. It's exciting.